tensions and political polarization are at an all-time high as voters anxiously await the results of the 2024 election. Whether it's your first time or you're a seasoned voter, it's likely a wide variety of issues are motivati motivating you to the polls. CBS News Miami's Ted Scouten is joining us live now in Hollywood. And Ted, you caught up with voters to just talk about their feelings right now. What'd they say? Yeah, you know, it was really interesting. We were trying to kind of gauge the mood of senior voters as well as young voters. So those who are kind of new to the process, voted once, maybe twice. And what we found is that they have very distinct outlooks. That I'm very happy and I'm going to do my part and whatever will be, will be. I guess I'm just really curious to see who's, who's going to win. So... Uh, anxious, excited, nervous, a little, little bit of everything. A divide on how younger and senior voters feel about the election cycle. We spoke to a group of seniors during a jewelry making session at the Fred Lippman Community Center in Hollywood. Abelio Corzo voted two weeks ago. Democracy is you um, express your opinion and the majority wins and you have to abide with that with that, with that decision. While opinions and political philosophies vary, the sentiment of senior voters seemed consistent. The whole idea of uh, the voting, it's a, um, it's a gift. Most of the seniors we spoke to already voted. The college students we talked to all plan to cast their ballots tomorrow. A little anxious. This will be De'Ara Roundtree's second time voting. She said the lead up to election day has been confusing. There's a lot of um, commotion on social media and with friends and family about you know what we should vote for when it comes to the different amendments. First time voter Brian Cardenas said that things are very uncomfortable right now. You can't really share your opinion because then you got that one uncle who's yelling at you, you got to vote this and the other uncle you got to vote that. So you know you kind of just keep to yourself at this point. So remember, tomorrow is election day. If you're going to vote tomorrow, you have to go to your assigned precinct. You can't go to those locations where early voting is. It has to be the assigned precinct. That goes on from 7 a.m. till 7 p.m. Live in Hollywood, Ted Scout, CBS News, Miami. All right, Ted, thank you. With 60% of the vote already in, the line should not be long tomorrow. That's right, we'll Ted, see. thanks.